co-workers. No, we're not talking about Bob McCounting. No, we're not talking about those co-workers that'll make you out of work, earn an honest day's pay while you're sitting on your ass watching Jerry Springer. You know who you are. You know who you are. Come on, we all done it. Don't even deny it, okay? Jerry, Jerry, Jerry. No, we're not talking about that. We're talking about a movie that's on YouTube called Co-workers. Co-workers is made by Do It All Productions, which is D-I-A Productions. For anybody interested, look at them up. It is a friend of mine's production. So granted, I did the song for them, and you'll notice that the Betty's name is on the script. Thank you very much. This is my review for the movie itself, so let's get to it. Co-workers. When I first heard about this movie, I thought it was going to be very dull. I thought it was going to be very bland. But honestly, I'll admit, and I'm happy to admit, that I was wrong. The movie was really funny. It had good characters, good script. What was good about this movie was the actors who played these characters. These actors are sat down comedians, and bravo guys, because you guys did a really good job bringing these characters to life, making them likable. I feel like after seeing this movie, I'm reciting like several lines of the film to my friends, and they're like, what the hell are you talking about? And I'm like, fool, I told you, this shit's on YouTube, <laughs> you know? I found myself laughing. Granted, there are flaws in the film, not enough lighting, shoddy camera angles here and there, and the audio goes in and out on two scenes. However, as a viewer, if you guys can overlook that, then I guarantee you that you'll have a good time watching it. It was independently made, but come on, so was Clerks. Everybody has to start somewhere. For this to be like a starting movie for these guys, and it's really funny, imagine what's gonna happen in the future. I can't wait. They had like this one joke where one of my favorite characters, Todd, was like, you know, the kid that looks like Colin Farrell with Down Syndrome. I shit you not, when I heard that line, I had to rewind it. I was like, dude, no, no, he did not just say that. He did not just say that. And then, even though I really didn't need to rewind it because he does say it twice in the film, you know, in that same scene, and it was really funny, I was laughing my ass off. It's like one of those jokes when you hear and you're like, oh! Hey! That's what it was, and I enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it. My favorite two characters in the film was Todd and Izzy. Yeah, the Iz man. Yeah, I'm calling you that. I'm calling you that. That They were like the douches of the film, and but they were funny douches. It wasn't like they were the douche that you're like, okay, I can't wait for something bad to happen to them. Like those other films. There's films out there that has the douchebags out there, and you just want to go. No, but there was a scene where these two characters were alone together in like, you know, the office and like the lines that they were spitting, it made me laugh. Like it was really funny. I recommend those who haven't seen this, it's on YouTube, it's for free, so check it out. And when you guys do check it out, come back to this video and let me know what you guys thought about it. Granted, I can't give this movie a brutally awesome because of the three flaws. Sorry guys, you know, Ooh, don't, don't, please don't, 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 don't. Ah! Put that stick down, we can talk about this. <laughs> No, but seriously, but you guys did a really good job. You guys didn't make a shitty movie or a waste of time movie. No, I'm gonna give you guys, I'm gonna give you guys a new rating, and it's just pure dope. If you guys, the viewers, if you guys are actually curious about this movie, the link is in the description down below. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, comment, tell me what you guys thought. Until then, guys, like I always say in my videos, keep it brutal.